Thorium could power the world for millennia, but it's the nuclear fuel we never used. Named after the Norse god of thunder, thorium is a silvery element found in common rocks and sand. Unlike uranium, which fueled the Cold War's nuclear race, thorium is far more abundant and produces less long-lived radioactive waste. Scientists have long known it could be used in reactors to generate vast amounts of clean energy. In the 1960s, Oak Ridge National Laboratory in Tennessee tested a molten salt reactor using thorium. It worked safely and efficiently, but the U.S. turned its focus to uranium. Why? Uranium reactors produced plutonium, essential for nuclear weapons, while thorium did not. Energy research followed military priorities, and thorium was sidelined. Today, the idea is resurfacing. India, with some of the world's largest thorium reserves, has made thorium reactors central to its long-term energy plans. Norway and China are also experimenting with designs. Advocates argue that molten salt thorium reactors could be meltdown proof, operate at lower pressures, and generate less toxic waste. Critics counter that the technology is still unproven at scale and that building new reactors requires massive investment. Thorium may never replace uranium entirely, but its potential remains a reminder. Sometimes the cleanest solutions are the ones history left behind.